If you're new to the channel, thank you and welcome. Please be sure to subscribe, hit the like button if you're enjoying the content, and don't forget to hit the bell to be notified every time I drop a new video, which is every week. So you're interested in a 0% down home loan. Well, you've come to the right place because today I'm gonna cover the answers for you. Stay tuned to the end for my bonus. to the channel, my name is Stephanie Weeks and I discuss anything and everything mortgage education. No, it sounds weird, but it's actually fun to me and I love sharing knowledge and spreading information. If you're in Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, or Florida, I wanna be your loan officer, so give me a call. If you're in the other states, I won't be able to help and it'll be purely educational for you. Either way, let's dive in because I've got all the scoop. Zero down home loan, do they exist? And the good news is yes, they do. And there may even be more than one option. And for some people, it might not be an option. So what do I mean by that? Well, there are a few different things that potentially can qualify you for a zero down home loan. The first one I'm gonna talk about is a VA loan, but if you're not a veteran, keep watching because there's still options for you as well. The VA home loan is a 0% down home loan, 100% financing for qualified veterans. That would be one option, but like I said, it's not the only. Another option would be an RD loan or a rural development loan. Now, there are income limits and there are area qualifications. So not all areas are eligible, as they call it, for an RD loan. How can you find that out? Well, you can search USDA RD loan eligibility and you can go to the eligibility chart and enter an exact address. You could also talk with the realtor that you're working with because she'll, she or he will have an idea or that person, shall I say, will have an idea of if RD is available in their area or not. And right now with the latest update on the income limits, I mean, you can make a really good living and still qualify under these income limits to be able to go RD. That's your second option when it comes to a potential 100% loan. Now, what is after that? What if you're not a veteran? What if you're not in an RD eligible area? What if you make too much money for RD, even if you are in an eligible area? Well, the good news is there still may be additional options for you even though those two might not be right. Would you like to know the answer? Well, as promised, I'll take a quick little sidestep and give you my bonus. I'm gonna put a download to a free PDF copy of my book called Mortgage Peace. And it's all about anything and everything mortgage, just like this channel, kind of unveil the curtain to figure out what this stuff means and why they ask for certain things and stuff like that. So hopefully you'll enjoy that. So let's dive right back in. When it comes to another option, there are actually conventional loans with as little as 3% down. Most people do not know that. Yes, 3% down. And then there's also FHA loans that are potentially as little as 3.5% down. Now, here's a quick little really cool thing. When it comes to RD, it's a single family residence. When it comes to conventional 3% down, it's a single family residence. You know something that's really cool? If you're going FHA, you can actually buy up to a four unit. That means you can buy a fourplex and live in one. You have to live in one because it's a primary residence type of loan. And you can rent out the other three and actually be well on your way to real estate investing with three and a half percent down. A conventional loan on a fourplex generally requires a 25% down payment. That's not gonna quickly, easily, and cheaply help you get into real estate investing, so FHA could be a good option. You might discover because you want to buy a fourplex 
that you might, you might even qualify for VA or you might even qualify for RD, but you might actually choose to go FHA because of that cool, really cool caveat. If it's your first time to the channel, welcome to my office. I'm so glad to have you here. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell to be notified every time I drop new videos on anything and everything mortgage education. Remember, I wanna be your loan officer. So whether you're moving in nine days or 90 days, if you're in Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, or Florida, call me, call me, call me, because I can help you. If you're in other states, I won't be able to help, but that's okay because I am passionate about sharing this information. As always, I'm keeping this really short and simple for you guys and girls and everyone out there. Thank you so much for tuning in today. I'm going to do a quick little plug because I built a first time home buyers massive mortgage education course that I usually charge $597 for. And I'm going to drop a link below for all of you to purchase it at $97. I'm just, words can't express. It's almost like growing a baby and having a baby. This course has been so much fun and so much passion and so much dedication has gone into this to not only help you get a great loan approval, a great pre-approval, but also help you with a smooth and on-time closing. So enough of that.